All right, y'all, so today I'm gonna be making peach cobbler in a cast iron skillet. Our ingredients are white sugar, brown sugar, cornstarch, nutmeg, cinnamon, vanilla, lemon, butter, and I have two cans of peaches. I know, blasphemy, no sugar added. I got the sliced pieces. I didn't want any of that heavy syrup because of all the sugar I'm putting in. And I have two pie crusts. So here I am draining off the peaches, but now you'll want to reserve the liquid or the syrup, excuse me, because that's what you're gonna use to cook your peaches in. Y'all, I really cannot stress enough. I think you should really get the peaches that have no sugar added. I ended up adding one and a half cups of sugar, but I feel like you only need one cup of sugar at the end of the day. So here I am placing the peaches in a stock pot. I added half a cup of brown sugar, one cup of white sugar. If I, if I could do it again, I will only do half a cup of white sugar, okay? Now I'm going to do a squirt of half a lemon. We have two tablespoons of butter in there, one tablespoon of vanilla. Uh, I'm not a big fan of nutmeg, but I still added it. I did um, half a teaspoon of nutmeg, half a tablespoon of cinnamon. I do love cinnamon. And I'm going to go ahead and pour that syrup in here and allow it to um, cook for a while. This right here is cornstarch and a little bit of the syrup to thicken it up. All right, you guys, so I have two pie crusts here. The first one I'm going to just lay down at the bottom. I'm actually going to bake that for about five to eight minutes before I pour in the pie filling. Um, and then I'm going to slice up the second one for about five to eight pieces. I'm actually going to cook in the oven, and you guys are going to see how it's going to come together. What I'm going to do with this right here is just press it up like so. I could press that down so it doesn't make a hole. All right. Doesn't have to be perfect, y'all. Does not, okay? All right, and I'm gonna pop this in the oven on 365 for about five to eight minutes. Yeah, let me press that down. I'm gonna lay these going across. Um, looking at it, looks like I, I'm eyeballing this, y'all. So, oh, hold on. I have some dumplings I kind of cooked in the oven. I'm just going to throw them in. And they're just going to fall. Normally you would do like a lace topping, but we ain't got time for all that. Let me kind of like so. And then the last one, go here. And then I have a brown sugar, cinnamon, crumble type thingamajiggy I'm gonna put right on top. Um, and then I'm also gonna do a little bit of butter. Here we go, going in the oven. 45 minutes later at 365, let me tell you something, baby. I wish y'all could smell this. This was so good that my husband and I killed half the skillet. I have no shame, no shame. <laughs> Cutting me my first slice too. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Take care. Bye.